Do stay behind me. It's a Patrick we want. Oi, Nesta, look who's here. What have we told you, nearly headless Nick? Hello, Sir Amzad. Do let us pass. We've brought a little something for Sir Patrick. Probably come to try to beg his way in again. <laughs> <laughs> Do they always talk to you like that? Ah, all in good fun. Once Sir Patrick lets me join the headless hunt, I'll be right there with them. This offering is sure to win him over. Uh, don't forget why I'm here, sir. Rest assured, you'll have your information from young Jackdaw in no time. Wherever he may be. What I'd give for a flagon of mead or a nice leg of lamb right about now. Then this party would be complete. How about the next best thing, Sir Patrick? Ah, Sir Nicholas. And a student. Who let you in? Uh, we brought you a gift. This is all very suspicious. What do you really want? As if I need to ask. Um, it, it's Richard Jackdaw. Uh, where can we find him? Uh, may we speak to him? Jackdaw, eh? Why, here he is now. What a shame. Without his head. I bet you've always wondered what that's like, eh, Nick? <laughs> <laughs> Sir, you jazz. <sighs> it's bound to be around here somewhere, probably being used in a game. If you find it, I give you my permission to speak with him, my young mortal. <laughs> it's the least I can do for you for bringing this putrescent gift home. Uh, sir, there's another matter I wish to discuss with you, if I may. Tut, tut, Sir Nicholas. How many times do I have to tell you our entry requirements are quite... Clear. <laughs> but, sir, I... Oh, we aren't the headless except for a little bit of tendon hunt, after all. Now, please, follow me and I shall help you find your way out. Farewell, my young friend. Perhaps your luck with these chaps will be better than mine. The headsman could only see me now. Hmm, a map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Revelio. My toy, she said. Who will be next to play our little game of hide and seek amongst the pumpkins? Hello again. Can you help me? Ah, Sir Nicholas's young friend. Has he abandoned you? Not at all. I need to speak to Richard Jackdaw. Sir Patrick said his head might be around here somewhere. Indeed, it might be. Hmm. It is a bit unorthodox to include a mortal, but if you do wish to speak with him... Oh, why not? You can speak with Jackdaw if you can find his head amongst these pumpkins. Not just once, but five times. Good old Dumfrey will move the head to a different spot each time you find it. Those are the rules. What say you? Why are you using Jackdaw's head for this game? Well, if you must know, Jackdaw's our newest member, so we like to put him through his paces. Please, could you explain the rules again? Find his head amongst the pumpkins five times. How did you happen to become a member of the Headless Hunt? I was executed alongside some fellow mutineers. We didn't like the way things were being run in our county, so we took matters into our own hands. Treason is such a strong word, but that's what we were found guilty of. Things would have turned out much better if they'd let me be in charge. If that's what I need to do to speak to Jackdaw, I'll do it. Marvellous! Of course, a mortal holding a wand has an advantage over us ghosts. You can simply blast away to your heart's content. Remember, the game's not over until you find him five times.
begin! Cast away until you find him! Rebellion! Discovered already? Looks like we need to find another pumpkin to hide it, eh, Jack Dorf? Whatever you say, Dumfrey. This is not my finest moment. That ghost said I should blast away to my heart's content. Rebellion. I've never seen it played like this. How delightful. <laughs> Rebellion. Won't be long now. You will find him. Here we go again. I could do that too if I had a wand and a body. Oh, what fun! A steam display. You make this look easier than it's supposed to be. I'm glad I won't be the one to clean up this mess. Revelio. Who would have thought a mortal would be so good at this? Why did I come back here? Revelio. Congratulations are in order. Not too bad for a mortal. Now, say what you need to say to old Jack Door here, hmm? You've earned it. Nicely done. But what's going on? You're not a member of the Headless Hunt. No, I'm not. Sir Nicholas said you might know the location of some pages I'm looking for. Merlin's beard. I know precisely the ones you mean. I pinched them from Peeves. How could I forget? The map on those pages led me to my demise. I was not ready for what awaited me in that cave. The pages are likely still mouldering away with my, uh, uh, remains. Quite a final adventure, I must confess. The pages are why you lost your head, and I must visit a cave and search for your corpse. Yes. <sighs> You'd think a decapitated ghost would get used to the word corpse. Say, here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll show you where to go. What will I find in the cave? Aside from my mortal remains, if I remember correctly, some treasures, a magical bridge. But what kind of an adventure would it be if I spoiled the surprises for you? Did someone in the cave cut off your head? I was having a look around when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze. After which I felt, well, light-headed. That's all I remember. Hence, when you visit, be prepared. I can't tell you what for specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Beware a light breeze. How is it possible to steal from Peeves, a poltergeist? I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of destruction. He has a penchant for wrecking things. Books, bottles, suits of armor. Whatever's likely to cause the most chaos. I found them after he ran riot through the library. Doubt he even noticed they were gone. I need those pages, so I suppose I'd better meet you. Thank you. Not to worry. I'll just need to be reunited with my body first. But Dumfrey can handle that. See you at the forest's edge. A wonderful night for games.
Hogsmeade, here I come. Come on in. Healing potions are a speciality here, should you need any. Very good. Never hurts to keep my stocks replenished. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Rebellion. Rebellion. Ah. 
here. Incendio. This place has seen better days. Here I am, as good as my word. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. Just like a Gryffindor to brave the forbidden forest in pursuit of adventure. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say Intramuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Aside from the birdbath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks. A stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Lumos. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. Hmm, yes. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best I leave you to it. Simply stick to the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. Akio. Is that what? Surprisingly, as good as his word. <sighs> Lumos. Revelio. Lumos.
something oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. There it is, just as Jackdaw described. Right, Intramuros. Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. But, uh... Those loyalists will report back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jack Doors led me. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. I wonder how big this place is. I can shoot the symbol, but it doesn't stay lit for long. I need to light all three before they time out on me. Someone didn't want casual visitors down here. I 
I wonder if any of my spells will help me through this. Rebellion. Tarotor wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave.
Revelio. That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no... Rebellion. Another puzzle. Well, if Jackdaw could solve this, so can I. Perhaps the next symbol is hidden somewhere. Rebellion. Rebellion. Accio. Rebellion.
Revelio. skeleton in sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. It's a good thing Jackdaw didn't fall down there. Akio! I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Akio! Rebellion. Search of this cave. Revelio.
There it is. The bridge, it's almost complete. More spiders. These can't be brought the head of little jack to Rebellion. Rebellion. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm. But I may as well help myself to this. I need to look around for the symbol. Getting closer to Jack Doll's remains and those pages. Revelio. We meet again, Richard Jack Doll. Thank you for keeping these pages safe all these years. Here it is, the map that brought your doom, Jack Doll. Hmm. Is there something beyond this room? Thank you. 
Incendio. Let me know. Repairer. Rebellion. I've seen this before. Gringotts and the restricted section. Where am I? Oh no. The room's starting to flood. Am I being protected? What sort of magic is this? I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. What is this place?
can it be? It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morgan Ark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention. And might I presume you share our ability? To see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss. But first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. I'm a bit confused, sir. Why is this room called the map chamber? I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. The statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside, those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that I would be here? I cannot say more at present, except to say that your presence here does not entirely surprise me. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We shall speak again once the book is in place.
and send me. I found the pages and the map chamber. Why would I need the book? How nice to see you. I'm back at Hogwarts. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't be back to study while he was away. Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Thank you. 